Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a very, very popular video and that is a Fashion Nova haul. So I've previously done a Fashion Nova haul and it's fair to say I picked up some cracking pieces. They were insane. Since then I've noticed a lot of videos about Fashion Nova. I feel like because before I didn't know about the brand, I never really clicked on their hauls. But I was doing some research, I was seeing what other people thought and there were some mixed opinions. But I thought it's time to do a round two and see what I thought the second time round. And I picked up some different and some slightly more casual pieces this time. Last time it was much more of like an evening wear, night out sort of theme. And this is a Valentine's theme video, which you may have guessed by this top. This is from Fashion Nova and this is one of the first items that I picked up. So this is a t-shirt. Well, no, it's not a t-shirt, is it? It's a very exaggerated t-shirt, but it's in this beautiful jersey fabric. It's red, it's got the stripes, it's perfect for Valentine's Day. It is quite cropped. I will obviously show you guys all of them on and this retails for, I've, I'm wearing it, but I kept the price tag on it so I could tell you. Should I pull it off now? Oh, so I got this in an extra small. It is Fashion Nova brand, and this was at $27.99. So this is a mock to the crop top. Mock to the crop top. Just a little FYI, Fashion Nova did let me pick out these pieces, but my opinions are obviously gonna be as real as they come, because I can't do anything different. But yes, beautiful top. I absolutely love these exaggerated sleeves. You could wear this a million different ways and the quality is lush. Like you can't see my bra or anything, which is brilliant. Perfect piece for Valentine's Day or any day because these pieces are kind of based around Valentine's colors, but I'm just kind of showing you that you can wear pink in December, June, July, August, February. You can wear red whenever, like you go gal or guy whatever floats your boat. So here is one of the ways I would style this red long sleeved top. I think it's great because I've shown that you can take quite like a typically dressy top and make it quite casual. I've just teamed with these red Toby joggers and these are so comfy and they are the perfect shade of red for this top. But you could also pair this like a pair of ripped jeans or jazz it up with like a little white skirt to bring in the stripes and some red knee highs. So it's such a versatile piece and it's such insane quality. Like the jersey is such that it keeps you warm. Like I'm normally really cold when I'm filming but I'm in a crop top and I'm fine. And um, it's not so heavy that it's uncomfortable. So I am absolutely in love with this top. Oh and I've got some makeup on it. Whoopsies. So next up. We are going to move on to a very extra piece. So this is probably what a lot of people wouldn't expect me to pick up and it is a camo print jacket. Now it is expected of me because it's pink but camo necessarily isn't a pattern that I've delved into that much and I've never really liked camo but then I got the Carly Bible two piece that I wore for New Year's Eve and I've kind of fallen in love with camo. So there will be another camo piece coming up in this video, but this is just a very girly version of camo. So it's obviously pinky tone, mauvey sort of shade. And I think that's perfect for a little bit more of a feminine camo, camo, camo wearer or your everyday camo wearer because it just gives it a little bit more of a girly touch. It obviously will be perfect for Valentine's Day, but I think you could dress this piece up and you could dress it down. Like you could wear it just with jeans and a t-shirt or you could wear it as like quite a pretty dress and then like completely clash the styles. You catch my drift? So this is an extra small and it was $59.99. So I will pop on the screen what the UK equivalents are because you may not be watching this from the US. You might be from the UK and wanting to order. So yes, absolutely love this. It's quite like a light jacket, like it's not gonna keep you warm. So you'd need to layer underneath, but I feel like this is a fashionable piece. Like it's not something you wear for warmth, it's something you wear for fashion. Oh, and delivery wise, so I think it took about two weeks, but they are really good with their delivery. They give you the tracking number that you can track it as it goes from the US to the UK. I didn't get an import fee tax, import fee tax, import tax fee, and I never have with Fashion Nova. I don't know how, they seem to have like magical gods that just work the border systems, that 
they, I never, I've never got import tax, so yeah, I don't think I've ever heard of anyone getting import tax either, so yes. Now, I hope I'm proving that you can wear camo and still be girly and feminine. Obviously you don't have to dress this jacket in this way, you could just put it with a t-shirt and a pair of jeans. But I've kind of like dolled it up and made it look a bit French with the beret. Yes, I'm in love with this beret. I got it in Poland, but they have the exact same one in Topshop. Then underneath, I've just got this little River Island jumper and of course the Zara skirt. But obviously the main star of the show is this jacket, which is quite like oversized, but I quite like that. And I do feel like you need fitted clothes underneath. Otherwise you look a little bit like a sack, but this is just so cool and not, not, not necessarily something I'd normally pick up. So yeah, we're trying new things in 2018. Now we're next going to go on to a little bit more of a dressy piece because maybe you are dressing up this Valentine's and you just don't know. And shock, it is in pink. So we, oh, I'm, I'm stuck to my own sleeve. So we will have all seen these little two-piece shorts shorts and jacket sets all over Instagram they have literally been everywhere but I actually haven't seen any pink ones so of course as soon as I saw a pink one I had to pick it up so this is the size small and I do think it comes up a little bit big on me I think I could do with an extra small and they don't actually have a smaller size in this which is annoying but I think I'm just gonna get it taken in so fear not and this was $49.99 so like $50 I never what I always wonder why they say it as $49.99 rather than just 50 because like I'm not gonna buy it because it's one dollar cheaper or one cent sorry not dollar like oh 99p store why don't you just make it a pound then we don't get annoying penny coins that just saying so anyway yes it's got a little clip at the front to do it up so you could obviously wear it bare or with a lacy bra or with a top underneath and it's just a little blazer with the big old pearls on them and then the shirt shirt shorts are pretty much the exact same thing really cute and it's a really beautiful color of pink it's a little bit more of a wearable pink because it's not like in your face it's quite like a muted pink so yes i thought this was so adorable and yeah i i feel like i need to go out somewhere to wear it but we all know I will not be going on a Valentine's date because who's got time for boys? Not this gal. Now we've got the most adorable little cord. Now this is the pearly jacket and shorts. Now the, these pearls are, I don't know, oh they're like metal clipped in. So they aren't going to go falling off. You're not going to go losing your pearls whilst you're on your night out. But I think it looks really beautiful with this little classy frilled shirt from Iris. Now, I like how I've kind of made what has previously been like quite like a sultry outfit a little bit more like feminine and girly and a little bit more like I'm going to a wedding rather than I'm going on a night out. And I think obviously if I took the top off and I just did it up, then I could go for that vibe, but I'm not sure I'm cool enough to pull off that vibe. So I shall stick to the cute little girly look. I'll also take off the jacket just so you guys can see the shorts a little bit better. You can probably tell from the video that they are a little bit big on me, but nothing the seamstress can't fix. So yes, so cute, looks so beautiful with anything of this sort of pearly white colour, and it's such a cute piece. I feel like I said that this video was a more casual video, but now that I'm like seeing the pieces, I'm like, Mish, you don't do casual. There's like three casual pieces. The next piece is so extra and so insane and so like not everyone's cup of tea, but I don't care because I love it. And it is a purple ball gown. Now, not quite sure when I'm going to wear this, but who cares? Because you know those days where you're just sat at home and you're like, I really just want a ball gown to wear. Fashion Nova's got you sorted. So this is a beautiful, chul, low V, really strappy ball gown. Now, it's kind of like a ball gown for like your, a more normal, everyday person. And I know ball gowns aren't everyday, but like you could wear this to like a party, like you could wear it for fancy dress, you could wear it to like a really fancy dinner. Like, I don't know what you guys do. Maybe you go to balls every week. Who knows? If you do, I'm very jealous. 
But what I love about this is it's got the tool and then underneath it's got like the lining so you're not going to be peeping anything and you can also adjust the straps so if you want more booby out or less booby out you can change that and I'm pretty sure this was really inexpensive. So this is an extra small and it was $44.99 so $45 is what like £38? For a full length, full on like gown, that's insane. Like that price is on point. So thank you Fashion Nova because I can't wait to be a little princess. So yeah, I think this would make such a cute bridesmaid's dress as well. And I know they had other shades. Like I think they had a red and maybe a black. I'm not sure. But I will of course link everything down below so you guys can go and pick up any of these pieces yourself. How damn adorable is this dress? I feel like a little princess and I absolutely love it. This purple shade is so unique but it's so beautiful and as we can see styling wise I've just shoved my hair up in a little bun and I've just got really dainty little jewellery because I think this dress just speaks for itself. If you wanted to show less chest you could obviously put a big necklace but I love the like simplicity of it. And then it's got these little splits through the tulle on both sides. So you can still show a little bit of leg, but without it being too much. And oh, I just absolutely love this dress and it was such a bargain. Okay, we're gonna go back to camo, yes. Now these most certainly are a very un-Misha piece, but I've said that Misha is branching out this year. She's trying out some different styles. She's seeing what she thinks and she thinks she loves these. So I've never actually tried Fashion Nova jeans and I know that's what they're known for. Like everyone goes on about how insane their jeans are. So these are just a camo print I and M premium jeans size three. Now I'm pretty sure I got these in like a small or an extra small. They fit me really nicely. They're a little bit big around the bum, but I don't have a very big butt, so that's probably why. And whenever you see the Fashion Nova models, they're always literally like snatched waist, massive bum, massive boobs. And obviously I'm the complete opposite to that. So I think that's why it's quite good that I haul Fashion Nova stuff, because I'm kind of showing that you don't need to have the J-Lo body to look reasonable in their clothes. Well, I hope I look reasonable. So yes, I really wanted to try out their jeans to see how they fit and the quality is beautiful, the fit is lovely, I really really like them. I'm not normally a high waisted jeans sort of gal but I really enjoy this fit. They're really nice soft denim, like they're not restrictive, they're comfy. They've got some like rips on the knees and they've got some like raw hemming on the edges and I'm not sure how much these were. There's no price tag! I'll leave it on the screen, but yes, I absolutely love these. A little bit more edge for when Misha's feeling a little bit more like punky. Punky Rocky. Now, for the camo pants, I've just gone for a really casual black Zara tee that says overrated, and this little black cap. Now, these are honestly some of the comfiest jeans I've ever put on, and they just look really cool. Like, I think they're quite sassy, and they're very different for me. But I'm digging that style. They're kind of like army girl vibe, but in a fashionable sense. And I do think you could wear these in so many different ways. Like, I even think you could team up with like a trench coat or some faux fur, and it would just make it look so classy. So I'm digging the whole like army girl look. Mum's on the phone to her mum right now, speaking Polish, and she's like shouting out there, and I'm like, please stop. So then the final fashion piece we have is so Valentine's Day but also so like a sexy senorita or just like a springtime look. Spring? Summer. Like I can imagine this on holiday, like I'm going to be taking this with me away on some trips. I will be going to America this year, I am very excited. Orlando and LA, here I come! Yours, yours! If you're in the LA or Orlando area and you would like to um, work with me, let me know. Hi! I'm so excited. But anyway, yes, I can totally see this dressed up with a pair of heels or dressed down with a pair of sandals. So it's one of those really complicated to show dresses, but it's basically like a wrap dress with a asymmetric, is that right? Like, sleeve. So on this side there's the sleeve. Oh wait, no, they're on both sides. Oh, I'm wrong. Oh, okay. 
okay, it's on both sides. But the bottom of the skirt is quite asymmetric, like it wraps around, it's obviously a dress, I forgot to mention that bit, and you just kind of tie it. I'm not quite sure how you tie it perfectly, but who cares, it's fine, we go with it. And this is in a, this is in an extra small and this was $39.99. So I think that's pretty similar pricing that you'd pay for a pretty little thing dress of this style. And the fabric looks so expensive. Like I'm always a massive lover of this sort of, is this like polyester? Is it polyester? 99% poly, no, 96% polyester, 4% spandex. That's my GCSE textiles coming out for you all. So yes, beautiful fabric, beautiful quality, and perfect for any season. Dun, 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 Where's the bit? Dun. I think this dress makes me feel so like dancing on ice, strictly come dancing vibes. I feel like the emoji, but like in a pink dress and it being more like short and sexy but I think this is so cute again you can tighten these straps to get out less or more booby this is really complicated to do up I won't lie like I don't think I've actually tied it correctly but hey ho it still looks cute and I love this sort of like floaty skirt effect it's shorter and more cheeky at the side and then longer at the front but I also like how you can like whack out the leg and give it a little bit of like, I feel like I should be in the samba. And I've just teamed it with some bright earrings because I'm all about opposite colour clashing. I think it looks so classy. I think it really makes an outfit pop. And this makes it very like summertime Caribbean-esque. I feel like I'm from Panama or something, or something like Venezuela. But I'm most certainly not, but absolutely love this and the quality is just absolutely beautiful. Next things next, my camera battery is flashing at me so I need to get a wiggle on, but I also picked up some shoes from Fashion Nova because I've never actually tried their shoes before. And the first pair I picked up are honestly the cutest shoes I've ever seen. Now, I mean, I don't know if you guys can see all the details, can I, can we see, can we see? So these are a sort of like a midi heel shoe. It says on them that they've got memory foam insoles and it's in this beautiful sheeny satin-esque baby peachy pink. And they've just got a little strap. You can see I haven't tried these on yet, but just the work at the back is so beautiful. Like I'm so excited to wear these. I'd originally planned to team it with the um, jacket suit, but sadly the pinks aren't actually the exact same color, but it's fine because I have a million other things that I can wear these with. And they're just really beautiful dainty heels for like that classy event, if you catch my drift. Here are the world's most adorable shoes that I think would be perfect for any wedding, any prom, like they are just so beautiful, dainty, and they fit me so perfectly. Can we see just how classy the details on the back look? Team with this sort of satin pink. Then, the next pair of shoes I've seen all over Instagram, but they slay life and I can't. Okay, let me just grab the massive box. Okay, now these are actually really light, and it's gonna be no surprise that they are knee highs. I'm a knee high aholic. But we're ready for these knee highs. Ba bye yum! Yas, the most sassiest knee highs on the planet. Now these again have the memory foam insult. Now I tried these on and they're like really padded and really comfy. So that's real. Um, they do smell a little bit, but that's probably because they've been in a box for however long. But these are just so sassy. I got both pairs in a six. These are obviously like really high, but like the zip only does like part of the way. And then this bit's a bit more like loose, so you can like bend your leg and you don't struggle, which is brilliant. But I just absolutely love these. Like they are so beautiful. The quality is lush. And as you can see, they've kind of just got like a bronzy stud on them. I like it because it's a bronze rather than a gold. And of course, pointy because we're all about the pointy toe life and a stiletto heel so you could literally wear these with any black or gold outfit and just slay life like I might have to wear them in Paris even though it'd be really overdressed but this gal don't even care so here are the boots now would you believe that I don't actually own a little black dress so I've just chucked on like a jumper dress just to see how they look on and we can see they look absolutely beautiful and I'm in love so this has been my second second Fashion Nova haul. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I really, really love Fashion Nova's clothing. And 
I'm not just saying that. I think part of it is because I do like to think I'm very good at online shopping. Like, I'm quite good at seeing what's going to look nice. Like, I'm quite good at guessing. And I think, obviously, not everything on the site is necessarily to my taste or to somebody else's taste. A bit like the pieces that I picked up won't be everyone's cup of tea. But that's the great thing with Fashion Nova. They have so much stuff that you could literally find anything for anyone of any style of any size. And, yes, maybe it could bring in a few more smaller sizes as well, but... You know, I'm still happy, I love it. I hope you'll be doing another one of these very soon because I absolutely love Fashion Nova's pieces. The quality for me has always been insane. And yeah, I'm not sure what other people are getting when they're not necessarily happy, but I'm one happy bunny. I can't wait to wear all these pieces and I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please check the description box for everything linked below along with all the items that I styled it with because I do like to give you guys sort of a look to how I would wear them and make them my own style so yes that wraps up everything i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a like and subscribe to my channel and i will see you all next time have a very very lovely valentine's day with your pot of ice cream so bye guys